It is time now to look at some of the top stories from around the country trending on CountOn2.com right now. Authorities in Georgia say a police officer in his second year on the job was fatally shot at a routine traffic stop last night. Police say the officer pulled over a car in DeKalb County and the driver ran from the traffic stop. When the officer pursued him, investigators say the suspect drew a handgun and shot him. The unidentified officer died later at a local hospital. An American student murdered while studying abroad. Police say 21 year old Sarah Pappenheim was stabbed to death by her roommate in the Netherlands. Authorities were called to her apartment Wednesday. There they found Pappenheim with stab wounds. She later died of her injuries. Police arrested her 23 year old roommate, who has not yet been named. Sandy Hook Elementary School in Connecticut was evacuated this morning after receiving a bomb threat on the sixth anniversary of the mass shooting that left 26 students and teachers dead. Newton police say they received a call at around 9 a.m. that a bomb was inside the school. Officers were sent to the school and conducted a search, but they do not believe that threat was credible. The school was evacuated as a precaution and students were sent home for the day. Lastly, federal agencies naming a California farm implicated in the E. coli outbreak linked to romaine lettuce. We've been hearing about it often. The E. coli strain was found in sediment collected from an irrigation reservoir at the Adams Brothers family farm in Santa Barbara, California. Investigators at the FDA and CDC say that although there haven't been any new illnesses reported since mid-November, it's too soon to say that outbreak is over. 59 people in 15 states were sickened.